I say we go and burn down their roofs. West Melbourne finally took the hangman back into the fold. It's an evil bloody joke, that's what it is. He was hanging with a wet scarf. There'll be no violence. Anyone taking things into their own hands will be arrested and charged. That means you, Pat Farrell. Brendan Joshua, you're under arrest for receiving the proceeds of crime. You're not obliged to say or do anything, but anything you say or do may be recorded and given in evidence at a later date. Do you understand? What are you doing here? You bloody hypocrite. Your lock killed Harry. This is Abbotsford's turf, mate. Come on. So you were informant, was he? Yeah. Make much money out of here while he was informant? I don't know, off the top of my head, it was eight years ago. So were you aware of his other interests? He liked doing up old cars. <laughs> don't be a smart ass. While you were his controller, he was greenlit to pull arm robs. He paid me to look the other way. That's about it. And Ludo told you this? That's right. We got collars off his info, that's it. How much you pay her? Why don't you ask him? No, I want to hear it from you. You want to try and nail me? You go for it, but I'm not going to do your job for you. If I was going to knock off a West player, it'd be one of the young guns. Not a bloke who's on the way out. Why don't you take a seat, Mr. O'Farrell? Please, sit down. Now, you have three times been ejected from various grounds for incitement and menaces. You did three months for bottling an umpire. I'm passionate about the game. Get out. Yeah, yeah, we're going. You're going to need to be a bit more discreet than that. You go near him again and I'll charge you with witness tampering. I told you to stay away from Ludo, didn't I? Boogie's gunning for me, isn't he? And now the pressure's on, he's knocked off Ludo and he's coming after me again. You, you piece of yeah, look, shit. Look, we're looking at him, but we don't have evidence. You thought you'd use me to stir things up? Well, it worked. Well, he wants you dead for a reason. So what have you got on him? I'll give you what you want, but we do it my way with my people. You were witnessed arguing with him yesterday afternoon. Where were you last night? Raising a glass to Harry. Then a fight outside around 11, then at the bloody hospital till 2 in the morning. Good, we'll check with the medical staff. You do what you like. You'll need another suspect. Try one who owns a bloody gun. This is ridiculous. It's not even his jacket. Mr Penning, I suggest you calm down. You don't want to turn this into a public event. It doesn't belong to him. He's going to... Bloody hell, let's go. Come on, let's go. Come on, come on. Your son, you didn't do anything. Has this got something to do with the death of Nicholas Dan I'm afraid your friend Peter is saying you're the one who did this. What? No. Leighton? That's not true. Leighton's denying it. We don't think you meant to hurt him. We're not sure what happened though. We didn't do that. I didn't hit him with any brick. 